Hey, what's up guys? Today we're gonna be playing some Halo... F what is this? Hello? Uh... This... This is not the Xbox One, but... I'm on my Xbox One. And I'm playing Halo 3. Uh... Alright guys, if you can't tell, Halo 3 is now backwards compatible on the Xbox One, which makes me so, so happy. Halo 3 is my favourite Halo game ever. I love Halo 5, don't get me wrong, but Halo 3 has a very special place in my heart. So now that I'm able to play it on the Xbox One, you can expect to see a lot of videos of me playing this game once again. I am so, so hyped and so ready to play this again. It's the original game we're playing on the old servers, so people playing on the Xbox 360 can play with people on the Xbox One. It's just like Halo Reach if you played that, uh, so it's awesome, I'm so happy. I can go back to all of my old settings, look at my appearance, look at my Spartan, look at everything like that. It's, it's crazy, it's a really insane nostalgia trip, it really does freak me out a little bit. I'm thinking about making a video of me going through my old file share and looking at my old clips, so if you guys want to see me do that, drop a like down below, but I think what we'll have to do first is jump into a couple games of Halo 3, original Halo 3, and see how we do. I have to say, playing this again is giving me such a nostalgia trip, it is insane. This old menu, looking back at all the old stuff, like the bungee favourites, like this, it's driving me a little bit crazy, to be honest with you. Like, I haven't seen this stuff in years, I have not played Halo 3 on the 360, in such a long time, like, these, like, this is literally seven years old. These have not been updated in seven years. If you were the last people to get on the Bungie favorites, your creation is going to be here forever, which I think is personally really cool. I'm kind of sad that, wow, I, this one, this one is like one of my favorites of all time, and I have not seen that in a long time. That's crazy. But if you were one of the last people to get on Bungie favorites, you're literally a part of Halo history forever, which I think is really, really cool. Back to the future. Completely spelled wrong, but it is what it is. Coming back to Halo 3, like the 360 version, it does make me realize just how difficult this game was sometimes, though it definitely is the hardest Halo game, in my opinion, anyway. It definitely is not a, not a very easy game to get back into. One, it's 30 FPS. Two, the resolution is way, way lower than what I'm used to. Not saying resolution makes for a good or bad game, definitely not, but you know. For today's standards, this game does look a little bit dated, but it is okay, it's fine. I'm not like looking at this feeling a little bit disgusted or a little bit sick. It's, it's completely fine for what it is, a nearly 10 year old game, which is crazy to think about. Get a boy! I'm not bad, not bad with the BR. It takes a little bit getting used to, but put the practice in, you'll get back there. No problemo. Oh, nice. But I am so in love with this game. It feels so good. I'm not even joking. Even though it's an old game, it feels so right. It feels so nice to play again. I am just so ready to get back and just grind this game. It's a 10 year old game and I want to grind it and play it so much again. All my friends are super hyped, super excited to play it again. So, I mean, if you guys want to see more Halo 3 videos from me, let me know in the comments. Drop a like. Let me know what you guys want to see because I will 100% play this game so much more if you guys want. Okay, I'm done with this game. I got sniped in the head. I hate this game. It's terrible. I'm sick of it. But no, for real, if you guys want to see more of this, I will for sure do it. I love Halo 3. It's my favorite Halo game of all time. So I'm very, very, very happy I'm able to play the original again. But also another reason why I'm actually making this video is to kind of bring a bit more awareness that this game is a thing. That you can play this on the Xbox One. The population is not super massive yet. So, I mean, if you guys have a copy of Halo 3 or you loved playing Halo 3 back in the day, now is your chance to play the original again. Now is your chance to play it once again on the Xbox One. Maybe you have friends who still only have a 360 and you have the Xbox One. Well, you can now play this together again. So, get off your ass, put in your Halo 3 disc, download Halo 3 if you have a digital, and play it again with your friends. That's what I want to see. I want to see the population of this skyrocket back up, even for a little while. I want to see it go back up to where it once was. Well, I say that, it used to be like hundreds of thousands of people. I doubt it will ever get back there, but you know what I mean. Just, I want to see a lot of people playing this. Now, the sniper in this game is the hardest sniper. Not even joking, it is the most difficult. Look at that, look at that strafe. 
Look at him. But this is the hardest sniper to use in any Halo game by far. It uh, it just it's a little bit awkward, but that makes it really fun. It makes it super satisfying to use. So whenever you get a snipe with it, it feels extra extra good. Whenever you get them in the head, there you go. No, he's one shot. Oh my god, I'm dead. No, I wanted to lift him up in the air. Damn it, that's what I miss about equipment. Someone's charging at you, just threw one of those down, and they fly up in the air, and they're gone forever. I do always say I miss the bubble shield, though. The bubble shield is something that I really want to see come back in future Halo games. That was a sick bit of equipment. You just throw it down, you're covered for a sec, you kind of take a breather. It's a lot better than armor lock. That can literally go die in a hole. Like, lit I say that, it can literally go die in a hole. That frustrated me so bad. Damn it, dude! No, he shot me and I went right above his head. I still suck with the sniper. I need to get used to it. I'm getting back with the BR, but the sniper, it's awkward. Not gonna lie, I'm still finding it a little bit awkward, but, you know, that's what makes Halo 3 such a good game. It's actually a difficult game. Oh, reload. You're not gonna blow me up. What are you thinking? Okay. It's weird, I actually feel better on this game than I do on the MCC version of, uh, Halo 3, even though that's 60 FPS, looks amazing, you know, the graphics are great, it's weird how that works, how I actually feel better on the lesser version, technically, of this game. I hope I didn't piss anyone off by calling this the lesser version, I don't mean that in a, a negative way, you just know what I mean, it's not 1080p, it's not 60 FPS, but that's okay. It's Halo 3, and that's all that matters. Oh, hello. Don't snipe me, don't snipe, okay, thank you. If he had killed me, I would have been pissed. But I want you guys to leave a comment down below. What have you missed most about Halo 3? Maybe it's just gaming with your old friends. Maybe it's the custom games. Let me know in the comments. I'd be very, very interested in seeing what you guys have to say. Oh my god. Oh, I got him. All right, I'll take it. I used to play so many custom games with my friends back in the day on this game. And it's, it's crazy to think that... Oh, I nearly got him. But it's crazy to think that I might be able to go back. Wait, he killed himself with a grenade after I shot him. All right, I'll take it. I keep getting distracted because so many crazy things keep happening, but that is Halo 3 in a nutshell, to be honest with you. But I hope to get my old squad on and play some Halo 3 again, just, just like the old days. I mentioned this really old uh, custom game that I used to play all the time called Sky Castle, and a lot of people commented about it saying, you know, they've maybe found it, that I could maybe play it. Now that Halo 3 is ac actually backward compatible, it's a possibility. It could actually happen, which is nuts. I think that guy just called me a wanker and then left the lobby. <laughs> I'm sorry, I guess. He was nice beginning at the game of the game and then he called me a wanker. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, we're playing on Construct, some Team Slayer. Oh man, this nostalgia will never end. I swear to God, it, it just... It's too much. Too much for my little brain to handle. It's it's crazy. And I used to play this every single day. Oh, now I'm 22 years old, still playing it. And of course you get me. Of course you do. I was streaming this yesterday on my Twitch stream, which is twitch.tv forward slash ubernick. For any of you that didn't know, I was streaming it for like five hours. Five hours of just Halo 3, which is a long, long time. I'm confused. Okay, thank you, teammate. Save my life. But my streams are normally about four hours long, but for some reason, somehow yesterday, I did for five hours. And I wasn't like bored, I wasn't sick and tired of playing. I just I just wanted to keep playing. I actually went on to stream another two hours of Halo 5 straight after that, so my streams have been getting longer and longer. I've just I don't know. I really find my my enjoyment for it now, I guess. Damn it, I want to grab the snipe, go up the lift, turn around, no scope someone in the face, and get a cool clip. But already since coming back, I actually have done some really cool stuff. On my stream, actually, just as I mentioned it. Oh my god, a flamethrower. Alright, well, we can't not pick up the flamethrower. It just, it's not possible for me to avoid this thing. Thank you. Okay, well, I'm lit. I'm sorry, bad joke. Sorry. But yesterday on my stream, something really cool happened with me and my friend Neil. Basically, we're playing some BTB, and I'll, I'll just run the clip. I'll let you guys see exactly what happened, as it was pretty damn awesome. <gasps> Nearly a ninja. Nearly. Sideways a bit. Are you ready? Catch me, boy. Catch me. Catch me, boy. Oh! 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 Oh my god. Oh my <laughs> god. Yo! Clip that. Someone clip that. Can someone please clip it that? Worked. Dude, I literally just wanted to hop in the side, but I landed on top of you. Wow. I'm impressed. 
But stuff like that is why I love Halo 3 so much. Just random, stupid little things like that are just so satisfying and so sick whenever they happen. So the more I play, the more cool stuff will happen. So you'll probably see some highlight videos and some stuff like that on my channel in the near future the more I play this. So I'm very, very, very happy. Wow, he got me? Okay, cool. It is very annoying whenever you start a game with just the AR though, because the AR is absolutely just listen this game. Oh, okay. It's just listen this game. It's a, it's really not a good weapon at all. So makes things a little bit more of a struggle until you find yourself a BR. And don't even get me started on the Magnum. The Magnum may as well not even be a, okay. You know what, Mr. Laser? You know what, I'm sick of you. But the Magnum is pretty damn useless in this game, not gonna lie, it is uh, not the best weapon in the world. Let me see, can I, is it possible to get a kill with it? Dude, where'd you even come from? I made him one shot. All right, I need myself a dual wield Magnum because you know, dual wielding is a thing in Halo 3, uh, which I actually forgot about, that's how bad it is. I completely forgot you could do this in this game. So, hey, there you go, Mr. Dino Boy. Eat my dual wield magnums. But I forgot this was a thing in this game, which is really upsetting to say. But I'm happy it's back. I'm happy you can actually do that again. So, you know, there's a lot of things I do miss about Classic Halos. I'm happy it's kind of returned. Classic Halos is kind of back, in a sense. Come on, boy. No. Come back here. Thank you. Appreciate it. Dude, what? Wow. I mean, you can't kill them all, but my god, I could have swore that was a, a guaranteed kill. Please no one murder me. No! Okay, well, I asked nicely and he didn't listen. That's fine though, we won the game. Didn't do just as good that game, but it is what it is. Can't win them all. Alright guys, that's going to do it for today's video. If you did enjoy, make sure you drop a like down below. Leave a comment, let me know what you'd like to see next from me in Halo 3 as well. You know, there's a lot of stuff I can do. There's a lot of different game types. All that stuff. So if there's one thing in particular you really want to see me play, leave it in the comments down below and I'll definitely give it a go and hopefully try and make a video on it. And if you're brand new to my channel, make sure you hit subscribe. If you did enjoy subscribing, lets you know whenever I post a new video. If you enjoy my Halo videos at all, then I guess that's the best way of being notified. So yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Love you all. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.